Uh, he's joining us from the L.A. area. He's with us here tonight on Red's Room. He is our next guest here tonight. Uh, in May 2005, he was a secular Jewish 30-something L.A. personal injury attorney whose idea of getting up early on a Sunday was gearing up for the third quarter of the NFL early football games. Oy vey. Oy. Thirsting on the idea of playing in a band for the first time in a decade, he finally accepted his neighbor's request to get up at 7 of dark 30 in the morning. Oof. Ugh, on Sundays in order to participate. Eleven months later, his world was turned upside down. Was it upside down or right side up? I don't know. I didn't know what direction it was. This was I was spinning. Instantly he began leading songs on the worship team. And today, uh, of course, Lifehouse worship team. Calvary now, Chapel. Now Calvary I, Chapel. Okay, now I'm, I'm, I remember. <sighs> I remember. He was at Lifehouse. Now he's moved on doing great things at Calvary Chapel, Malibu, everybody. Yes. Um, his music ministry website, of course, robreed.com. He is a lawyer by day, musician by night. Please welcome Rob Banana Plank, Don McLean, Reed, everybody. One of my favorite words is shenanigans. You use it a lot. So because uh -huh. whenever you're on, I have to participate in the shenanigans. Of course. Yeah. We By the way, Crystal, you way. you played "You so Carry wrong. Me." She she did play "You Carry Me" before because it's now running. This is a little. This is a quick little uh, advert. Yeah. Alldayjesus.com is my little project right now. I've got a lot oh. of. New, we got music on there. We've got like Mary Oz who plays on here. If there's another artist I'd like to put that, we need demos and stuff. But Crystal gave me permission to put some of her stuff. And I think it was an August performance. And you can listen at alldayjesus.com and get You Carry Me. And also the song that we did. Is that your new uh, venture you've got going on here, Rob? It's one of them, yeah. It's, 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 I'm working on a 24-7 worship. Uh, where it also right now it has the preaching of uh, Pastor Brian the last time that he preached uh, two weeks ago. There so there's go. preaching, interviews, and uh, all sorts of neat stuff, but particularly music from some great worship artists like Crystal and Mary and uh, anyone else that wants to participate. There you go. Uh, and the website, we can go check that out again, is? Alldayjesus.com. All day Jesus, yes. Um, and, and did we trade in the one year Bible thing for this or are you still mad? Uh, yeah, well, I'm going to do a podcast. I, I was able to register. This was a God thing because it wasn't available last time I looked. Uh, there's going to be a podcast I'm going to do, which will have music, Bible studies and all this stuff uh, called Christ Supremacist dot com. Oh, wow. Fancy. Yeah. All so right. That's in the, that's in the project fancy too. ones here. Yeah, Red we, we get so yeah. absorbed we get absorbed with politics especially this year man it's gonna be so ugly oh you 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 took your youtube fandom and you kind of leaned into that didn't you well yeah i mean that's what that's where no, no, actually go. actually it was more youtube slash threads for you Oh. Are you, you're not watching my threads, are you? Because that's where I do all my venting. Don't go to my. <laughs> I know. That's why I said. Threads. I know. Stay away from my threads. <laughs> Thanks for mentioning it. Now I'll never uh, be no on problem. again. All right. No problem. Red anyway. asked if his shout out was on there yet. By the way, back, back to Jesus. Let's go to Jesus, shall we? Red, Red, Red asked if his shout out was on there yet. By the way. Yeah. Oh boy. <laughs> oh boy. Uh oh. I'm thankful to Jesus for notwithstanding all of my varied opinions. You know, before things... before we get before we before we get into the the first song here, so level with us here. Oh boy, what is what is the real version of the story when it comes to the banana plant grub? There there was no such thing. I was making a joke, and it turned and the and whole Olga, thing was made up. Olga took my joke. I said like the only time you're gonna if something like the only time you're ever gonna see me do a plank is if I slip on a banana peel, or I think <laughs> I said like I actually did. The only time I ever did a plank was I slipped on a banana peel. Uh -huh. and no, no one's going to see with a body like mine. The, uh, I don't think planking is even can be in the the bodily vocabulary. I could say the word. I could think about it. But the, the actual performance is what I'm saying, Joe. So I, it was intended to be a joke. And now it's going to happen for real. So I look out because we have bananas and I'm in my house. I'm walking around looking to make sure there's nothing on the floor. So don't, 
don't like you know people think i was lying i was just being trying to be <laughs> Okay. Are you, are you Can saying we get, you, are you saying you'd injure something if you tried? I'm saying that I would. Oh, it's ter <laughs> terribly embarrassing. Let's just say, Joe, uh, I, along the same lines, I tried Pilates one time. Oh boy. With my wife. <laughs> and uh let's just say <laughs> I, I don't even want to say this is a night of worship. <laughs> but when you tighten your stomach, you know, and you <laughs> And you're you eat a lot of things that make you gassy. <laughs> Joe shenanigans what, is the first, key word for song, the evening. First song, Rob, go ahead. First song. What do All we right. got? So what we're gonna do is we're gonna get we're gonna bring down right. We're gonna come down yeah. because the thing in in this world is that we. Uh, we have sure many sure things in life, uh, or we have a lot of unsure things, but one of the things that's gonna happen for sure is we're all going to die. We all break down. But through that process, one of the most beautiful things, I think, in the connection that we have with Jesus is the ability for us to have direct communication for him, with him and to, <laughs> to petition him for help when we need it, particularly with health and things. So if there's something that you have right now as you're watching, as we begin to, to go into a state of worship out of from the shenanigans, I want you to think about that thing and pray and put, post your prayer requests even in the wherever chat that you're in on Facebook in particular. Feel free to do that because this song is based on Matthew 15, 21 to 28. This is Take the Crumbs. And it's the Syrophoenician woman, the Canaanite woman, who was so bold and so faithful that she came to Jesus and she said, I know that you're not here for me, at least at that point in time. He was there for the Jews first. Amen. She said, notwithstanding, I just want to take the crumbs like the family dog and ask you, and because I know, Jesus, that you can do it, that you can heal my daughter. And he did it without having to be in the daughter's physical presence. It's a beautiful story, and it's a real story. And he is Jesus is real, and he's here right now. So any prayer needs you have, post them in there. Let's pray for each other as as I lead into this song. The crumbs, Rob Reed on Richard. Jesus, your greatness is beyond my thoughts. A small seed of faith is all I got. I feel not worthy, not of the chosen ones. So I only ask you if I could take the crumbs. Lord, you reply. Just believe. Stray from the ways of the world and I'll see. That the greatness of your mercy is found in the cross. Jesus, your greatness 
eyes beyond my thoughts A small seed of faith is all I got I am not worthy, not of the chosen ones So I only ask you if I could take the crumbs, Lord, you replied, just believe, stray from the ways of the world, and I'll see. The greatness of your mercy is found in the cross, mm, found in the cross, oh, found in the cross, oh, I believe, I receive, oh, Jesus, you say we from my sins, I Amen to that. You can go check out the uh, lyric video as well on his YouTube channel, which has yes, a bunch doggies. of doggies. He's he's he's, uh, he's and and the last video we featured had dogs too. I'm beginning to think it's like a running thing. It's a hook. Yeah, for, um, that that track. That's the the first song on the author of my story. Joe. There you go. There it is. See, so I have a new album oh, out. It was released. Yeah. Author of my story, Rob. Reber. December fifteenth, and I I'm even so old school cool that I make CDs still. You make CDs. Who? I like. I need something tangible, Joe. I gotta. I gotta touch something. You know, I can't digital's. You know, it's like it's good, but I just need a picture. You're muted. Are we all muted? But no, I don't think so. Okay. The lost art of the cover art and just something tangible, just in yeah, I, I I get you there. Yeah, if you grew up in the in the nineties and two thousands, you get it. Yeah, I'm a little older uh, than you, Joe, but thank you. Yeah. Before we get to before we get to our second song, uh, we'll make up some time here. The only thing I have to say is your wife commented, Marie, oh, no boy. Pilates. She's three words: no Pilates, <laughs> bean. She knows. There's only three words she says. Let's just say I'm very blessed and fortunate that uh, Pilates was an unknown before we got married. Because if if yeah. that would have been a deal breaker, I think. Uh, yeah, well, we're, we're very thankful it was not. So yeah, there she was stuck once the Pilates happened because we I, I already put a ring on it as Beyonce. You, you already deal is done. Yeah, that's right. The next Stop song, too, sir. Song two, uh, New Life. I'm playing this for, for Red. In the scripture here, Second Corinthians 5, 17. Therefore, if anyone is in Christ, he is a new creation. The old things have passed away. Behold, all things have become new. And this is kind of too. my testimony song that I kind of wrote. Like uh, yeah. the person that I recorded it with, he says, this is a song that I really like. It's kind of like a port song. And I said, yeah, I can go for that. Like a little song where we imagine we're on the porch together and we're thinking uh, about God and his goodness and the, the, the yeah. fact that he made us a new creation, Joe. And Amen to that. This is we're the grateful song. for that. This is the song. The heavens praise your wonders, Lord. So who am I not to join? With all I am, I sing your praise. For 
By your grace I have been saved I've been made a new creation By my high God Take me, Lord, as I am. There are no burdens in my path. Once a broken, wretched man, I'm made righteous by your hands. I've been made a new creation. By God, it's the start of a new life. It's the start of a new life. It's the start of a new life. A new life for me. Give me, Lord, the eyes to see More of you and less of me Give me ears that I may hear Help me know that you are near I made a new creation By my God it's the start of a new life It's the start of a new life It's the start of a new life a new life for me It's the start of a new life It's the start of It's the start of a new life, a new life for me. I was lost, but now I'm found. I was lost, but now I'm found. My whole world turned upside down. By my God, it's the start of a new life. It's the start of a new life. It's the start of a new life. A new life for me. Amen, Joe, wake up. Amen. Richard Andrew says, uh, a start of a new life. Yes. Uh, Elizabeth, the ninjas got her on that one. Literally her right now while holding on to the CMS mask. Uh, yeah, it's, it's, uh, it's, and it's, uh, it's a new life every day because, you know, we fall. We fall to Joe. My middle name is Shenanigans. Falter. Uh -huh. And uh, he's there to pick me up every time. And so... That song for me as a testimony song will never get old. Like so I love it at the start of the new year. The new year is when we're reminded of newness, yeah. new beginnings, new starts, resets. And the thing that is so beautiful to me about Jesus and what he says about us is that when we declare his name, when we believe on him and we believe in that beautiful gospel, most particularly of Christ crucified, Christ resurrected, he says, I'm the gate. Enter into the gate, you're going to find pasture. And you can come and go, but I'm never going to let you go. Nothing is going to be able to remove you from 
my hands from the gate. And that's, that's a quite a promise. That's a blessed assurance. And I, and I stick with that. And for those of you, if you're watching, maybe I'm just being led by the Holy Spirit, because it happens to me sometimes. If you think I'm not good enough, you're in the midst of some kind of, if it's sin or it's something that's burdening you, it's family relationships, whatever it is, bring it to God. And he says that he's never going to let you go. And he means it. He really, really means it. Thank you. And it's when, like, if you doubt, I would tell you, dear brother or sister, that your doubt is a key indicator that you have nothing to worry about. It's the people who, I think their hearts aren't turned to God. It's the old Israelites who were turning to other things, idols, believing in other things to have power. That, you know, that's when you kind of need to worry about your heart condition. But if you're doubting and you're, you're worried, that's a good sign to me. And that's, that's what I tell that I'm, I'm led to say that Joe, I don't know why, but maybe it's reaching somebody out there. That's our outreach message tonight. No, I'm kidding. Um, yeah. Goodbye. God bless. Yeah, good night. I say, I yeah. say good night, everybody. Yeah, I say Monica says time. great talent. Um, Lisa says it's absolutely her favorite new life. Uh, Ogi over there says, uh, <laughs> loves the acoustic version, by the way. Indeed. Love that stuff there. Song three, Mr. Reed. What have we got there? Sir? We're going to do the title track from the author of my story. How's that? Ooh, well, that would be it's the all author Chinese. of my story. It's the author. But it, but see, here's what I did. It's, it's the album's the author of my story, Joe. The song's called just author of my story. How's that? Okay. All right. And what sure. I love about this particular song the Lord gave me is it, the idea, the concept is that it's... Uh, <laughs> We do things on our own. We go through our daily lives and we think that it's all due to me. And if there's something wrong, I got other people to blame. It's not me. Um, but the bottom line is without the God who created all things, we're nothing. We need to constantly remember that. And that's what this song is about. Author Miss Billy Robert. When I think about my life And the stories that shape me I'd take in all the credit And shifted all the blame Without the God who created all things I am It's not about how I feel Or the great things I think I've done When I make it all about me The truth is it's three to none Without the God who created all things I am for my story is the king of the universe the creator of all things when I tell my story he must be first the author of my story let us fix our eyes on Jesus the perfection when a story's more about us may the spirit bring correction without the God who created all things we are nothing the author of my story is the king of the universe the creator of all things when i tell my story he must be first the author of my story he holds the keys to the universe he created everything
everything What makes me think I can change the course On my own I can't change the course The author of my story Without the God Who created all things I am nothing Now with the God Who created all things Child of the King That was a doggy song there too, Joe. I was a dog. I was gonna say, yeah. There's a video for that too, lyric video with a dog at the end, with a with a crown on his head. That's that's why we noticed if this was a new hook for you. If 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 you're just putting dogs and if I can't get people to listen to me, you know, because of the music, let's get them there for the cute dogs. You know, dogs. Yes, I'll do anything. You know, that I can. (laughs) <laughs> well, it says, these songs are speaking to my heart darn it needed this right now in ways i cannot explain That's good stuff great. there she's uh impacted tonight uh, um also um i'd like to thank everyone for watching out there uh olga says rob you really need to do acoustic albums sometimes sounds so special well that's that's actually in the way i already have registered like i oh. have the the cd like I just haven't done the songs yet. So she's, uh, I appreciate the confirmation because I'm going to do a bunch of versions. I think I might do a couple covers of some other songs, like more popular. I'm not sure, but uh, it's called All is Stripped Away and it's going to be songs that are just going to be acoustic based. Yeah. Look for it sometime between now and 2030. Uh, 2035 on that one. Oh, 2035. Yeah, the okay. Crystal song right. first. Yeah. We'll see what happens. All right. I couldn't decide what I wanted to do for the last song. Jose Joe. Barajas says, great songs, Rob. Uh, great to have him here. Oh, uh, yes. Final song. What you got, Rob? Um, I was debating between Christ's Identity, which is a nice song, except I, I have a nice little organ on that. And since I, can, I like the organ-based version of that, so go listen to it. The message of that is, uh, I love the, the chorus there, is, to do is not to be when I'm in Christ's Identity. And that's, I'm not singing that, but it's a good message because when we, I'm doing your, uh, your sermon again, Joe, a little quick one. (laughs) That what I love about like the (laughs) the burden that we have in Christ, it's an easy burden. It's an easy yoke because he guides us and when we're open to him. And so our good works that we do as not to something that we earn salvation through but naturally we're led to them like this every worship artist tonight is out of the goodness of their heart but mainly because of their love for jesus we're here to celebrate him and what he did that uh it naturally comes out to us in the same way that a bird just flies a bird doesn't fly because it's a bird a bird flies just because it is a bird and always was and so since we're a ch- children of God, we will always be in Christ's identity. That's that song. So look at that. I'm not going to play it, though. So I tricked you. This one is Joe Perfect for me. Leads to, into it. It's called More My Silence. You see, you can tell with me and the shenanigans with Joe, I talk a lot. It's a part of my career, unfortunately. So, But I, but I, I, I love to talk. And oftentimes our talking gets in the way of Jesus. And so less of me, more of him. I wrote this song as a prayer to remind me of that. Jesus, help me hear another story. Close my mouth, slow my speech for your greater glory. Cause there are many who are hurting, just want to be heard. But my mouth trembles, and my mind battles to speak out a turn. Oh Lord, please help me listen, help me yield, 
Help me find my voice at a loss For less of me, more my silence Just might lead a soul to the cross Jesus, guide my words To point more to your story Steer my speech Lead my lips for your greater glory Cause there are many who are hurting Just wanna be heard But my mouth trembles And my mind battles To speak out a turn Oh Lord, please help me listen Help me yield, help me find my voice at a loss For less of me, more my silence Just might lead a soul to the cross Oh Lord, please stifle my tongue Keep watch on the door of my lips Make me slow to speak out in anger, quick to hear, with more my silence. Oh Lord, please help me listen, help me yield, help me find my voice at loss, for less of me, more my silence. Just my lead a soul to the cross Oh, help me listen Help me yield Help me find my voice at a loss For less of me, more my silence Just my lead a soul to the cross Oh, Lord, please stifle my mouth Lock the door on the speech from my lips Make me slow to speak out in anger Quick to hear With more my silence 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 More my silence Amen. Good reminder, Joe. Yeah. Um, Who told you that one? Olga says that's uh, probably her favorite of yours now. There you Thanks, go. Olga. Thank you. Uh, where can we continue to keep up with uh, you and your music and some of the many things you got going on? Where can I got a lot of things going on now. So we got robbery.com as a one-stop shop. All right. And then you got alldayjesus.com where you can hear Crystal Craven. And then the first song, You Carry Me, that she played there, but a couple others too. And the ver- our song, We Shout, We Sing. Uh, I'm on Instagram. I'm on Facebook. You can find me there and Spotify, Apple Music. Follow me. If you haven't followed me on Spotify yet, I said this last time too, follow me and I'll send you a free digital copy of the latest music, the author of my story, eight songs that include uh, three of the songs I played tonight. There you go. All right. Let's pray for Rob. Let me just thank you, Lord, for everything you're having him do right now for the kingdom, whether it be the all day Jesus site, his music. We just ask that you would just continue to expand his reach, continue to have him reach the people that he's called to reach through his music, through his um, hosting, through his podcasting, through his pastoring, even. 
through his worship leading, whatever you have him do for the kingdom, I just ask that you would just have him um, do it with excellence and just continue to have this gift and his light shine before you, Father. We just thank you for everything you're doing. Continue to provide for him personally and professionally as only you can. And we just thank you for uh, Rob being here tonight. And uh, we just thank you for everything you're doing in him and his family's life. In Jesus' mighty name, amen. Amen. Thank you, Joe. And we thank you, Father, for Joe and Red and their ministries, too, and Elizabeth, too, for, for being the unsung hero behind the scenes. That's for sure. Thank you very much, sir. Always a pleasure. Rob, read everybody. We got